we finally found all these videos of this woman going crazy in like some kind of a store. Well, let's watch it. Oh God, no, it's you, it's you, uh-uh, uh-uh, now you are, oh my God! You, oh my God! I'm assuming she hit her because she was getting recorded. Why did they, where did the video start though? This is one of those problems, like why, what we, where, why didn't we start at the beginning? Like what's going, what happened to make her go that ballistic? I'm not justifying, I mean she hit her, she's an idiot. But I'm just confused. God! Uh, uh, do you see this? Oh my God, I'm not. I never thought nothing like this would happen to me. She just tried to run and hit me. And now she... Did you see her? You saw her, right? They all saw her. I wonder if, like, they started recording because of an altercation or if they just... I don't know. Oh, my God. Karen had a breakdown. She tried to hit me. Oh, the, the crazy lady pushed her in the store. That's what people are telling me. And then she started recording. Yeah, that's perfectly logical reaction from this, this person. Ask your workers. She tried to hit me. Okay. Oh, there you go. She yeah. tried to hit me. Now I want security for you. Oh, my God. Why aren't they kicking this fucking white bitch out of here, honestly? Oh, my God. You should have thought about that before you did what you did. This woman is pathetic. <laughs> Loser. This do not feel real. Yeah, I'll tell you, bro. Why aren't the workers doing anything? Bro, you... don't record me. Was it over a pair of panties? That's fucking pathetic. Had to get security. She, she charged me. If I wanted to duck, she would. Oh no, no. Oh no, you just. Bro, I don't understand. Like, if I hit somebody, I would be like, bye. I would leave. Figure you get the fuck out of the store. Want security for me, right? I want security for you now. No, don't cry. Yo, I'm not even. No, no, no. I want you to call security. I thank you. I just came to get my free panty. You know how you get the coupon in the mail? And hey, I got to pick up my that. Converse boots from Nordstrom. <laughs> I don't know why this is happening to me. Oh, there she got a free panty coupon. I could, don't charge me. Oh, you wanna, oh, Dude, yeah, she, is she like in the witness protection program? What the fuck is happening? No! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, this woman apparently tried to hit the girl recording, and then she's like, "Don't!" But she's the victim. Don't, don't record my mental breakdown. Bro, don't have a mental breakdown. Leave the fucking store. Like, are the free panties worth that much to you? Where you can't just leave? You're obviously in a mall. Cause that's what I'm assuming. Because she said something about going somewhere else. Maybe it's some kind of an outlet. Go to another store or something. At least she's saying, "Please, no, get the fuck out of here." She's saying, "Please" to be the play victim. Bro, kick this fucking psycho bitch no, out of the store. Away from me. No, I yeah. Said, no, 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 no. We're not doing this. Why don't I walk away from her? Why don't she get away from me? She could get away. Go wherever you want to go. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Why are they all being so in support of this white girl? This is crazy. <laughs> I love this fucking person recording. What is? <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! Look at her. She's laying on the floor like a fucking animal. She's pretending to play dead. What does she think? The black woman's a bear, and she's gonna like fucking forget that she's there and like walk away. Like what is it? Or she thinks she's a T Rex. She's just gonna be like, oh, I don't know where the fuck she went. She's not moving anymore. Like what is happening? Yeah, because... Bro, where the fuck is security? No, I had one. We were trying to just find a price check for one of them. Just one I had. Yo, just give this woman her fucking free panties. Actually, you know, um, I have a coupon for the free panties. Mm -hmm. and I love how casual she's excluded, being. Except for the period panties. But I actually want to see what that was. I can show you. Okay. I respect <laughs> that. <laughs> that was so funny. Bro, holy shit. That was so funny. Wait, let's look at part two. Keep lying, saying I'm threatening you, so I'm recording to protect myself. No! Yeah. Bro, get this bitch out of the fucking store. She's screaming. Get, I'd be like, yo, you have to leave. You're you're scaring away customers, bro. I'd record her too. Jesus Christ. I'd hit her in the face at this point, bro. I'm sorry. I mean, it's a woman, so I guess I wouldn't. But like, I know my fucking my my girlfriend would smack the shit out of her at this point because this is you're just being obnoxious. In fact, I guarantee you, I know how my fucking girl would do 
would, would handle it. She would walk up to her and say, excuse me, you're being very loud. You need to shut the fuck up. Like, I, she, she's a behavioral specialist, so she would talk to her um, and talk down to her. Like, it's nothing to do with her being a behavioral specialist, but she would be, like, professional sounding, you know what I mean? But also a bitch at the same time. Like, she knows how to mask her bitchiness and, like, professionalism. It would just be, like, a funny thing to watch. <laughs> <laughs> Stop laughing! What other choice do I got? Crazy lady. Okay, she attacked me and tried to say I attacked her. You cut. Yeah, look, look at this. Get away from me! Oh, y'all better get this lady. Security! Security! Look at this! What the fuck? Get, get her away from me! Get her away from me! All have mercy! I love that she's laughing. Bro, I'm sorry for laughing, but I love that the woman recording is Get laughing. Oh my god. No, I gotta just protect myself. She's trying to attack me. No, no, no. No, I, I don't blame her at all. See, and she's saying I'm threatening her. I'm not saying nothing to her. This to protect me. Once the law get here, who they gonna believe? Her white ass or my black ass? I do not blame her at all because you want to know what? I use, you know, guys, I'm very against like the whole racial bullshit. I'm always like, yeah, it's not a race thing. Bro, I honestly wouldn't doubt. Like, why the fuck isn't this white woman out of the store? Like, honestly. Like, why is it taking fucking 10 minutes for the security officer to get there to get her out? I I'm not saying it's a it's because she's white. But I'm also not saying it's because she's not white, bro. I just kind of feel like she's getting, like, a, a, a special fucking white woman meltdown privilege. It just seems so weird. She's screaming at this black woman saying she's threatening me. Get away from me. It's like, what? Get her away from me, please. Stop her recording from me. Where is security? In this short hills, y'all. Oh, oh, my, my God. God. Short hills. <laughs> Get her away. I got to stop coming here. Dude, I don't get it. Yo, you're scaring away customers. I mean, I respect it. The cashiers probably don't get paid enough to deal with this fucking bullshit. She's screaming like an actual five-year-old. They turn the music up! They turn the music <laughs> They turn the music up! Oh my god. Oh my god, guys. Which is bad if I make it a YouTube video because it might get censored. Let's get the fuck out of the store, bitch. There you go. You got the Italian one. Come on, let's go outside, eh? Is that even somebody working there? Or is that just some fucking Italian woman that walked by and said, all right, I've had enough of this shit. Get the fuck out of the store. Bro, that's just a fucking woman shopping at the store. You have just some old Italian woman shopping at the store. It's like, get the fuck out. Get You, get, you with somebody? Like, is your handler here? Get the fuck out of the store. Of course, it's the Italian woman. Good for her. Look, it's just some old fucking Italian woman. So like, get the fuck out of my store. Or oh, not even out of my store. She's lying on the phone. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> I love it. She said I threatened her. Well, I don't give a fuck about her being sick. I'm worried about me. Oh, she's sick. Oh, because she's having a meltdown, she must be sick. She's a fucking crazy bitch, all right? She's not sick. She's obnoxious. She's a fucking petty child. You hear this? Yo, y'all can't think y'all hear this? This stuff y'all read about. This is real. This is really happening to me. Yeah. She's on the phone with the The phone. new Get Out, out movie looks wild. Yeah, for school. sure. Dude, where's the security, bro? The he security guards are fucking school. terrible. They got to be rolling. Where's Paul Blart rolling in, in there with this fucking mo his little uh, scooter? That's your fucking problem, bro. That's your fucking problem. That's your problem. I, I'm not trying to be rude, but I think that we would all benefit if she had a heart attack because then at least she would shut the fuck up. You know what I mean? I'm not trying to be an asshole, but... I just came to get a free panty. I just came to get a... Hey, I saw all they go. I just came to get a free panty. That's all. That's I, re all. I respect it, dude. And get the yeah, if you get free... Oh, this looks like a good deal. Maybe I'll go. Dollars off. See what free panties will get you? This lady to chase me. <laughs> She's all the police on me now. 
like, I can't believe this long and security not here. Right? You gotta get the cops here. This is how black people be dying. You see this? Maybe she's not. Nah, I don't know. Don't panic and tell police that you're doing something to them when you clearly saw her chase me around the store. She's right. She's got a good point. <laughs> she tell them, get here. I'm helping. My heart's racing. See, see, see. <laughs> Bro, this is how five year olds act, react. Oh my god. Is that security? Oh. Uh, I don't want to turn my back on her. I want to pay all my stuff, but I'm not turning my back on this white lady. I'm sorry. She is crazy. Did you see her just try to charge me again? That's yeah. The third time. Now I want to see what the police got doing again. Yeah. Oh my god, she just left the store. That was literally the solution from the start, guys. She did it. It only took her 10 minutes to leave the store, but she finally managed to fucking do it. Oh, she's back. <laughs> just leave the fucking Whoa. store. That's how they be getting us killed. You see this? I mean, shit, bro. People are trying to help her and ask her to step out the store. No, she, I I, I, of course I'm not helping you. Why would I help you? You're trying to help me. <laughs> True. Uh, See this shit? Yeah, she needs a fuck. See, we got fucking Britney Spears in the conservatorship. This crazy motherfucker needs a conservator, bro. She needs to have no autonomy over herself. This is this is psychotic. Come here now. I'm threatened. You feeling threatened doesn't mean you are being threatened. She's recording me. She's recording my mental breakdown. <laughs> she pushed me to this point. Yeah, she pushed me to this point. Yeah, she pushed me to this point. She's recording me. Oh, no. Wait, what is it? What? She was on recording her and she was unfriendly. And she'll say that she said she'll stay her six feet away from her. I'm assuming that's a COVID reference. What is this black woman doing wrong? Oh, she's really unfriendly? Bro, imagine. What? I'm so am I. I don't like. What do you, why would I, anybody be friendly to you? It's true. Oh, you know, it's funny. The world wouldn't have cared if this didn't go on for so long uh, and if you weren't having a fucking mental breakdown. But this is so funny that th that's what it is. This is hilarious. This is the worst day of your life is the is the best day of my week. Right. And like everybody agrees. That's why they're watching it. I don't want her posting anything on my personal stuff. Oh, well. Get that phone down. Oh, it didn't work the first 40 times. Where is the mall security? True. This do not. I swear to God, this do not feel real. <laughs> this girl's making Trisha look normal. Yeah. Since I had that accident, I, like. Oh, uh, she's got bad voodoo feel, going on. I, I don't know. I'm gonna just say, you know, everything is. I've been watching a lot of Supernatural. There was this episode with a rabbit's foot, and then you touched, you got a lot of good luck, and then it luck turned after you stopped touching the rabbit's foot. It's crazy. Maybe that. Maybe this woman's got that problem. A lot wilder. The cut of a lot. It's nothing I can do. I'm not even gonna. <clears throat> well, she's gone from the store, so it's got to be over, right? Okay, I guess she's gone. Thank God. There's a lot of videos, though. Okay, so that was the second video. Security? But apparently there's more. Uh, this lady tried to attack me. Bro, how the fuck are you going to get here 20 minutes security? later? You're a fucking mall security guard. There's absolutely no... Like, what were you doing? You got one of you guys? You taking a shit? You got fucking 20 white women everywhere going crazy? Like, is it? Is there, like, a fucking white women, like, pandemic? Or what's happening? I am. What can I do for you? Uh, this lady tried to attack me. She chased me around the store. Everything. I, I was over here looking at the... Uh, you can ask the workers. I was over here looking at the, um, the sale items. Right. So she came back and she put a... Wait. She came back and she put an item back in front of me, so... Okay. After she put the item back in front of me, she begins skimming through the calls, like right in my face. I said, excuse me. Then she just completely went over to them, asked them to secure. Oh, she got in a personal space, it sounds like. So she got in the girl's personal space. The white woman got into this woman's personal space. She's like, yo, get the fuck away from me. By the way, I do that too. Uh, you don't, let's, like, let's not act like I don't do that. I get pissed, especially with coronavirus. People get close to me. I turn around. I look at them. It makes me angry. Stay the fuck away from me. Like, it, like, literally is corona season. Like, you keep your six-foot distance, motherfucker. Don't, don't invade up on me. Security went off. She dropped on the floor. She screamed. She chased me. As a matter of fact, where is she? Uh, well, I don't know exactly right now who you're referring to. Um... I
I guarantee you that this 17-year-old fucking the mall security Paul Blard look like he probably was heard it and was like, I got to get out of here. I'm not dealing with this today and probably just hid until it was all over. Here we go. Is everything okay? Is like, I, I don't know. Is I'm everything okay? Manager. No, everything's not okay. Ask them. She Sounds like a bird, me. bro. Excuse me, man. You're the manager, right? Yeah. Could you come over here and tell him what this lady did? She chased me around the store. Yeah, why is everybody acting like it just didn't happen? So I was like, is that... Attacked in the mall, almost attacked in the mall. The manager, I okay. had to run behind her. I chased him around. He's telling me he can escort me to my car, but she's not. she doesn't have to leave the mall. Listen, I'm not finished shopping. I have two other stores to go to. I'm saying. I can't... I'm, I don't work for the mall. I can't order her. Anymore. Yeah, but you work for Milburn. I was just almost assaulted in this mall. I, I can't... I can't... The mall security can act. What I'm saying is, I'm not telling you you have to leave right now, but I'm not saying that, but... For, for some reason, if, it was on, if the shoe was on the other foot... And I would have tried to attack her white ass. You would have me escorted out this mall. <laughs> That's just how I feel. This woman, the, the, mind you, the manager didn't told him. The manager told me he chased. Huh? I wish he didn't feel that way. I do feel that way. I do feel that way. I was just. I do kind of feel bad for this cop, but like I don't understand what what gets me more than anything else is that like yeah, they're not looking for the lady. It doesn't seem like the 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 mall, the people at the mall are particularly concerned about this white bitch. Because it just doesn't, it doesn't click with me. Because if you had her having a meltdown, you would, like, you should call the police. The fact that the white girl was the one that called and not the, the, the management there is fucking stupendous to me. It's fucking incredible. It doesn't even make sense to me. Um, despite the fact that she had a literal meltdown, she needed to be kicked out of the store. And so now, for whatever reason, it seems like nobody is on this girl's side recording. And I don't understand it. Everything I've seen, this is insane. Bro, give her the panties without having to make the fifty dollar purchase at this point, at least. Almost attacked and assaulted. Are you telling me? And I feel bad for the cop, I guess too. And he can't, he can't get out. You hear this? Um, if you have any concerns, well, I'm going to give me this lady. This is the lady. They won't kick out the mall. I'm a dog. Where is I'm the lady? I'm going to act up in front of y'all, which I would do. So he's telling me that. Um, first I, of all, I don't understand why the like ratio is like. Why are there dislikes on this video? Why are there 555 Karens going like, I, this, this is, must be, all be her book club? The manager already said she tried to attack me. I want her to, be, to leave the mall. No, no, no. It's, it's just like she was recorded. I don't understand why she can't be escorted out the mall. She tried to attack me twice. Yeah, for real, bro. She should be escorted out the mall. <coughs> okay. See this? And she's crying, and they just being all sympathetic to her tears. I don't care about her white tears. <laughs> she needs to be escorted out the mall. She chased me around the store and tried to attack me twice. Bro, I'm fucking st stupefied. Is that a word? I'm fucking stupefied. <laughs> don't worry, I can get you in here. I can't hear. No, she should be escorted out the mall. She tried to attack me twice. You doing that because she's white and she's crying. Maybe. I am nowhere near her. I don't, just, I don't have to move. I'm not breaking any laws. Now, you get so aggressive with me. Get aggressive like that with her. Well, he wasn't really aggressive with you. Look at this shit. See this shit? I think they might actually be kicking her out. <clears throat> this lady chased me around the Victoria's Secret store. <laughs> Literally. Chased. And the manager told them that she chased me. And oh, the manager, anything, the manager even crying. said that? Look at this shit. Mind you, she crying. She chased me around the store. I should be crying. <laughs> I got chased. True. My what? The initial video that you talk about. Yeah, I sure can. Can, can I have the, the email and the case number, please, for today? Because I'm definitely going to go straight through. Just because of your partner's smugness. What's yeah, the way your partner looked back at me like, oh. Like, I don't have time for that. <laughs> She's saying her rights were violated. At least this fucking officer seems to be trying to do the right thing. It's one of those things where, like, from their perspective, they showed up in the middle of it, so they don't know what they can and can't, like, what to believe. Like, you have to give them a little bit of a break. Uh, Stupefy is a disarming spell from Harry Potter? Okay. But like you have to give them a break because they don't they're coming into like a scene where they don't understand. But he's getting the information from her. But it's like, what are they gonna do? This white bitch needs to get kicked out of the mall now. You know what I mean? So it's like it's not really not much is gonna happen in the way of justice. 
Well, we All right, so if you would, this, that's what we're working on, just if you can send the initial video. That's, you know, okay, can I have the case number for today? Okay, let's see the next one. So I see everyone asking me for an update. I am at the police station. I have the police report, which is somewhat true, but really, really long. I'm happy I did record because even the officer stated that I only showed him the video of her laying on the floor when I showed him everything. Oh, and guys, I have her name now. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> he put, oh, dude, he, she, she's fucking, she's, uh, she's getting a cutthroat here. Holy shit. Excuse my language. Abigail Elphick. Okay. That's her name right here, I'm assuming. <laughs> so she just put her own name out there as well. She's like, I got her fucking name. But this is your name, I'm assuming. Now, I don't know how to, uh, to pronounce it, but... Mm -hmm. It's really, really long. You see this? Double doxed, bro. It's fucking double doxed. And mind you, they took her statement first because, of course, she called the police. Well, yeah, that's usually how it works, though. Some of these things are and just... She completely lied. Uh, what does this say? I'm trying to read what it actually said. All right, so she stated that she was next to a woman who asked her to move, I guess, um, which caused her going to a panic attack, and they started videotaping her. And then the fucking crazy woman said that she got anxiety. Proceed to go inside the store and speak to the other person. She said that Miss like selected an item and was asked to back up. She's like, yeah, she sounds like she went crazy because she got asked to move. And she completely lied. She's trying to say I started videotaping her, calling her to have a panic attack. I mean, maybe that is what happened, but like you started videotaping her almost because she, she was she going to be ballistic. Cool. Um, See this? Shit's crazy, bro. So I'm filing a complaint against the two officers that responded. I didn't feel protected. I'm also filing a complaint against the fucking ball, bro, for um, not doing anything. What do you call them all security? Victoria's Secret. It's like, you know, in my opinion, like, what do we expect them to do? Like, grab this woman and, you know, the manager even sent somebody. To walk down to get security because they were taking too long. So yeah, that's a mall's problem. I don't really have any issues with them, not as of yet. Now, if they give us problems getting a video and all that, then we'll talk about that. So you know, that'll be another. Be investigating story. Report. But yeah, I'm so, gonna read this in its entirety. There's so many parts to this. I feel like I they're... just had to hey make guys, a real quick video to message. this. I'm I spoke so with thanks. Miss Crazy Lady and advised her that I spoke to the store employee and that they corresponded that Miss that what Miss Ukenta said had. What Ms. Ukenta has said happened. I don't know how to pronounce her last name. Did Ms. Blank seem to acknowledge that she was wrong, saying she was concerned about losing her job and apartment if the video posted online? But nobody would have watched if she didn't have a fucking meltdown. And that she was having a panic attack about the videotaping. I advised her that Ms. Ukenta has a right to videotape. I asked her several times if she was all right and if she needed an ambulance, and she declined repeatedly. She kept expressing her concern about her job and apartment. She finally stated that she was going home, and I asked if she would be okay to drive, and she says she was. At this time, Miss left the mall voluntarily with mall security. They got his full name, yeah. Escorting her. I then walked over to Miss Lukinson and again advised her of the procedure for signing a complaint with the court and asked her to email. He didn't explain that to me. He didn't tell me how to file a complaint. I have that on video, too. That's terrible. He didn't explain to me how to file a complaint. I got to look at it. I don't remember that. In case I'm wrong, I'm gonna look at that video again. We well, so give you the complaint number. Ask him like three times just to get the case number. So I walked over to me, blah, 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 and forced her to claim the court. I searched the email her videotape. You did ask me to email my videotape. I remember that. So I could submit it with the report, and she said she would. I gave her the case number as well. At this time, myself and I just PO wonder what like is gonna come of this. PO Ford was completely and utterly dismissive of me and gave two, you know what, about what was happening to me. You can even see, look at all this concern from this lady. Nobody asked me, was I all right? Did I need medical attention? You know, for all they know, I can have anxiety too. And this woman sent me into it. That's thing. true. They didn't ask her anything. She did get attacked. That's actually pretty shitty of them. They didn't They didn't seem to ask her at all. 
Unless I missed something, but she's really the victim in this case. Yeah. Dude, it just goes to show you that if you have no pride, and if you're a fucking loser, and you just cry, bitch, and moan, that you'll get whatever you want. Because this fucking person, like, aggressed onto her, and then she just cried, and then, like, we're like, oh, are you okay? Hey, you won't be investigating a report. Would you but you, you ask... You're asking me why I'm complaining yes. on your officers, and I'm telling you I can show you a video, and you're telling me you don't want to see the video. I don't, I don't want to. I want to hear from your mouth. What is? What is it? <laughs> All right. So I was in the mall. Basically, they didn't protect me. They didn't. They didn't try to make from the woman that was trying that attacked me and chased me around the store. They didn't ask her to leave or anything. They said they weren't able to. They weren't able to ask her to leave the mall. I've never heard of such a thing. Because if I was chasing her around the store, I'm sure I would have been asked to leave the mall and or arrested. Well, and I showed him the video. Why do you believe that? What you mean why I believe that? Because why do you believe that? Okay. I'm I, I don't really don't want to play this game again today. You know, this happened to me Saturday. I'm very emotional about it. Okay, I'm asking you, I want to file a complaint against your two officers. You said I can do that with you, right? Because I, I, I see this I'm gonna is getting over. I'm gonna give you an internal affairs complaint form. You're gonna fill it out. I'm gonna pass it on to the internal affairs unit, and they'll they'll be doing the investigation, okay? I see, I'm gonna need a lawyer. Anybody that can help me with a good lawyer reference or point me in the direct, right direction, please help me. Cause you see how this is going. I wonder what she could really get out of it though. Cause like they, they didn't ask her if she was okay or anything, but like there's no like damages, like nothing actually happened. It's just like they were being a pieces of shit so and dismissing her. Advice, and I just started All right, this is just a GoFundMe page. I don't really oh. care about that to be honest with you. Uh, I mean, if you want to take a look at the GoFundMe here, I'll reopen it. And if you guys are so interested, the GoFundMe advice. is down here. Uh, I guess if I don't know, maybe if you click on her thing, I don't know. So the GoFundMe is is right here. If you guys want to go fucking type it into your little little PO box number into your little internet browser, you know what? this is just more like exposition from her. With everybody. Nothing like particularly. Twitter. Yeah. So, all right. Yeah, that was fucking incredible, bro. That white woman went crazy. What a dumb asshole. Hey everyone, if you liked that video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow my Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, Discord, and TikTok. All links are in the description. Also, check out my Patreon if you'd like to support me even more than you already do. Thank you so much, everyone. I love you all.